One of the biggest problems I have with digital cameras is their instant nature. I'll often snap a photo before thinking about the framing, angle, light, or anything else. Then, upon seeing the photo, I make the necessary adjustments and reshoot. It's rare that my first photo is the one I end up keeping. But during my recent trip to the UK, I decided to document my journey with a different kind of camera, the Fujifilm Instax Mini 40. This camera works similarly to a Polaroid, producing small prints that capture a single moment in time. Using this camera it proved to be a nice stepping stone from digital to film. Because it only takes 90 seconds to develop, I could get quick results without having to send off a roll for development. So with that in mind, I loaded the camera with a pack of 10 prints, and I was on my way. Well, I took a plane, then a bus, then slept in a hostel, then took a train, and then I was on my way. I suppose I should introduce you to Lena and her slobbery friend Deacon. While my main purpose for this trip was to visit some friends and to see a bit more of their corner of the world, Lena and Deacon's purpose was to get as many walks as possible, which ended up being exactly what we did. Exactly how I remember being in the UK, though. Giant rocks and rain. <laughs> yeah. Just on cue, five minutes later, the sun is out.
I think this camera is quickly becoming a travel essential for me because no matter how many photos I take on my phone or digital camera, it's more challenging to show someone photos of your travels when they're all on a hard drive somewhere in the house. Having photos that someone can hold in their hand or maybe that can populate a coffee table photo album at some point is a far more enjoyable experience, both for myself and for the person hearing the stories.